क्लास सिक्स चैप्टर टू कॉम्पोनेंट्स ऑफ फूड द ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ टूडेज लेसन आर टू इंट्रोड्यूस द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कॉम्पोनेंट्स ऑफ फूड देन टू एक्सप्लेन कार्बोहाइड्रेट्स एज अ कॉम्पोनेंट ऑफ फूड अंडर द फॉलोइंग हेडिंग मीनिंग एंड फंक्शन सोर्सेस एंड टेस्टिंग the learning learning objectives are the students will be able to list out various components of food they will be able to explain carbohydrate as a component of food under the following heading meaning and function sources and testing the various components of food are carbohydrates proteins fats vitamins minerals and dietary fibers so what are carbohydrates carbohydrates are energy giving food they provide us energy to work play and to do our work in short these are also called carbs there are three different types of carbohydrates according to american diabetes association the first one is called starch or complex carbohydrate the second one is called sugar and the third one is called fiber there are various sources of carbohydrates sources of starch are starch vegetables such as corn lima beans peas and potatoes so this is a corn this is pea potato and lima beans they contain a lot of starch the other sources are dried beans lentils and peas such as pinto beans kidney beans black eyed peas and split peas another source of starch is oat barley and rice the sources of simple carbohydrate or sugar are the sugar found in milk called lactose sugar found in fruits called fructose and added sugar called sucrose some of the sources of uh, fiber are very helpful for our body and fiber is also a type of carbohydrate that our body cannot digest because this fiber cannot be broken down into sugar molecules and hence they pass down the body undigested but they help regulate body sugar use keep hunger and blood sugar in check some of the various sources of dietary fiber are amla or gooseberry apple with its peel avocado pear orange almonds walnuts prunes white beans oats barley carrots broccoli and cabbage how can we test for the presence of starch in order to test for the presence of starch we have to follow the steps we have mentioned here the aim of the testing should be to test for presence of starch materials required are iodine solution potato a dropper a note copy and a pen to record observations the procedure of the testing is we have to take a potato cut it into half then add iodine solution drop by drop what do we observe we observe color of area where iron solution has been dropped turns blue black what is the conclusion starch amylose present in potato turns the color of iron solution into blue black some of the extra information for you iron solution contains potassium iodide so what is our end note of today's lesson we should eat whole grains and other carbohydrates every day as carbohydrates are sources of energy for us due to which carbohydrates are also called as energy giving food but we should avoid eating too much sugar to prevent our body from diabetes